Hey, what's up, guys? Gaming Ryan Tove here. So I'm back with another Pixel Gun video, and we're gonna do what we left off on the campaign. And oh, I crafted a new gun, the trick or treat gun. But yeah. So wait, let me see. Um, like, okay, so it's in backup. What, what does it shoot out? Oh, are those like bats or pumpkins that it shot? But yep. So I crafted a new gun. So we left off in spaceship, so I'm gonna skip all of this because if you've seen the video of part one, then you know the drill. So, all right. So we know for a fact that there are more than one generators. So yeah, in this video, I'm gonna try to beat it. And yep, I wonder if there's another one like this in the second level. Okay, so we know for a fact that there's more than one. Yep. Okay, let's reload. All right, it's done. Take those spider mines. So yeah, so apparently our character is inside of a video game right now. Yeah, take down those. Okay. So reload again and then shoot those phoenixes and yep. Right, so I'm gonna go collect that and so yeah, when those spider mines explode you they do damage you. They just damage oh I'm out of ammo. I have to use my other one. Okay, I don't know what this one's called, I forgot its name. But it looks like it has like a Rubik's Cube on, on its thing. Even I think the other gun has it. Looks like a little Rubik's Cube is got there. And I died. As usual, I'm not giving up though. I don't give up so easily. Alright. So let's try that again. <coughs> Alright. So we're gonna go find the, the creatures that are destroying the generators. Yep. It just got a lot harder. I actually wonder if there's another one like this in the in the third in the I mean not the third the second level. All right, we're gonna go reload that one. Okay, so this one seems to be like some kind of I don't know virtual pistol. I, I think this gun's better. I'm using right now. This gun's better. It's like a machine gun, and yes, it does have a Rubik's cube on top of it. I think that's the one I just used right now. Yeah. I also like the reloading animations. It reminds me of like a sci-fi game where you're like fighting aliens and you have like these kind of guns. And four more. Okay, we got this. Three more. Come on, destroy them. I wonder if this has a boss though. Does it? Yes, it does. Every level has a boss. What is that? It looks like Dr. Octopus from Spider-Man, obviously. Like, can you guys tell like the arms? It looks like Dr. Octopus. And we finished it. Okay. So that was some kind of drone. All right. So we completed the level, three stars. Okay, we barely fought them off. You must have a lot of questions. Let's start from the beginning. You're not the only one stuck in the web. Everyone is held here by Cubic. Here is the web. He creates his games. He doesn't let anyone who gets them back into the real world but together we will start revolution okay but we can't do this alone we need the help of champions who who are the champions they are the most powerful players that can be found in cubic games entering this game feels weird we are on our way to the, the champion cubita he's destroyed so many towers and citadel collapse okay i'm just gonna skip that Okay, so this one is weird. Okay, so you don't have to je defend any generators in this one. So I think it's like the normal pixel gun, old school classic pixel gun. Wait, whoa. Oh, are those cannons? Yeah, I think they're built. Oh, this is, this is cool. I like this gun. It's pretty like some kind of flamethrower, but in a virtual version because you know, we're inside a video game right now. Well, I'm not inside, my character is inside. Okay, so yep, it's a, it's apparently like a game within a game. Yep, does that make sense? A game within a game? Uh, I don't know. Okay, so yep. Alright, I think those things are goblins. Yeah, I think those are fire goblins or demons. Okay, more cannons. And I saw a ghost over there and walking trees. Yep, I remember the walking trees from the first level of um, the third world of Pixel Gun. Okay, let's take down that demon first. And another walking tree. There's another one over there. Let me use my um code gun. 
and my flame, my virtual flamethrower. Right. More spirits, and I died. Again. Let's try that again. Alright, I th I'll just try this one more time. I don't know how long I've been recording. I should probably get a timer because I have to still check whether or not if it hits 15 minutes. Because if it does, then I have to cut off the intro. So just so you know, got just so you guys know. And yeah, it, yeah. But I know in order to not let that happen again, you have to verify your channel. And I I don't want to talk about that right now. But let's just keep firing at the monsters, and everything will be okay. All right, I just have to make sure that it's not more than 15 minutes. Okay. Ooh. Let's shoot that. Yep, so they're literally throwing like explosive balls at us. Are those like fireballs? Yeah. Okay. Let's take down that, that demon. Well, I think it's a demon, but... Alright. More explosives coming by. I can see a ghost turning invisible okay i'm out of ammo there's ammo right there give me give me it's mine everything's mine i'm just kidding guys i'm just i'm just just kidding okay all right i just love to joke around and stuff i i'm like a big fan of like being around all right let's take down those and i'm out of ammo again i have to use this the code gun okay who else wants to test me come on who wants to test me yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna die soon. I lost my armor and everything. Yeah, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Uh oh. And yeah, see, I don't jinx it. So I'm just gonna leave it here. I I will do this in part two. So I just hope you guys enjoyed the video. And yep, I'll see you guys in part three. Yeah.